Okay, folks, found a nice little backup utility for Android called Sync Droid. What makes this cool and why I like it is because it actually gives you the ability to back up your phone to Windows, to a, a laptop or a desktop, and then back out again, restore it back out again to a new phone, which makes life a very, very simple thing indeed. Anybody who's ever struggled with trying to upgrade from one phone to another will know that it's a real pain to do backup and restores. A lot of the products don't work properly, they fall over and stuff. Uh, I've just tried this Sync Droid stuff and it really works and it's free. Um, let's see how it works. It's quite simple actually. In s you download the actual software from the site, the Sync Droid site, um, the Windows software. There's no Mac version unfortunately. You can also use a, a, an Android app, but I prefer the Windows version for reasons which will become apparent shortly. Plug your old phone into the USB cable into, into your computer and it will go through a whole bunch of gubbins about um, setting up drivers and stuff like that. Once that's done, you can click connect and it will look for the Android phone that's been connected because these things don't happen instantly. If you get this, this is uh, basically telling you that your phone needs to accept USB debugging. Turn on your USB debugging function which is a developer option and then unplug and replug your phone and there you go it will actually give you a little picky after a while of, of the, the home screen of your phone there you go as you've just seen and it's very very simple to uh, to use because what basically what you got here is the amount of space there is on your phone and on your micro SD card if you have one in there and a backup and a restore button you can also that's also replicated down here on this side here so backup is what you'd expect choose what you want to, to back up SMS contacts call logs albums and videos and photos the only thing is it does give a warning about backing up browser bookmarks and says it can crash the the uh, the software in which case try it again without backing up browser bookmarks and I did that and it, it actually had a problem with it so I un checked it but everything else you just do that give it a name and any notes you want to put in there and press backup and that's it and it'll start doing the backup and backing up your contacts and SMS's and all that kind of stuff I won't do this because I've already done this once before once you've done that, unplug your existing, the old phone, plug in the new phone into the USB. Um, you may have to go through the same process of setting up deep, um, uh, the developer options on there. So USB debugging, so that it works. It will look again at your phone, tell you exactly what's on the new phone, shouldn't be very much. And then you can choose whichever backups you want to you to restore and just click restore and boom you're back up <laughs> so, and that's it <laughs> it's very simple so uh, i find it uh, i found it a, a really quick and easy way to restore back up and restore your all your sms's and contacts and all those kind of personalized things that you build up over an age from the old phone to the new phone and if you use that in conjunction with the app mover program that we we found a while back then you'll have your whole setup done in a split of a second especially if you kept your google account all backed up that's sync droid hope you enjoy it as usual if you enjoyed this video please like it and share it and subscribe to our channel so we can bring you more cool stuff